Hello everybody. Uh, today we have uh, radar detectors. I've actually got two of this model and uh, neither of them make sound anymore. Um, they usually you know, beep at you, um, a few different styles of beeping noises. Some of them talk but I don't believe this model is, uh, is one that does. Um, but uh, yeah, during its startup uh, procedure and possibly when you uh, push other buttons, I'm not entirely sure on this model, but definitely when you first turn it on and it scrolls through the display, I can show you that now. It should be beeping every time that display changes. So, uh, uh, as I say, we've got two of these. Um, both done the same thing, and uh, I know of a few others um, that uh, have also failed in the same way. So uh, it should be interesting to, to see if we can figure out uh, what's caused this. Let's crack it open. I'd just like to add that, uh, yes, I've checked the settings. Um, I've gone into programming mode and uh, made sure that it uh, it's actually does have some volume, you know, basic setting set. It's not, it's not forced on mute or anything silly. Uh, and I've done a reset uh, to default settings as well. So I'm fairly confident it's not a uh, software glitch. Right, so I've got the uh, bottom cover off. And of course the two end covers. Uh, and... Um, first glance nothing appears to be physically damaged um, you can see the speaker down in the bottom right there and uh, having a close look at that um, can't really get a close up without it uh, blurring too much let's get a zoom there we are, I'll zoom in oh, that's too far Um, you can see you can see the top there where the leads connect on, and uh, if I uh, have a have a have a close look at that, and I can see that one of the leads on the left is actually um, uh, there's there's really not a lot of clearance between the circuit board and the speaker when they made this. They haven't really allowed for the wires there, so it's really pushed up hard against the the, the circuit board, um, and it's almost pulling the um, the, the red lead off off the speaker completely so um, we'll just uh, pull that off and uh, uh, we'll pull out the PCB and have a closer look at that make sure that's well attached now it's not that easy to see with this camera but the red lead is um, uh, it doesn't look like it's even the, the wire tin, uh, strands haven't even been tinned properly before um, uh, being soldered on. It's like they've just blobbed a, a, a big wad of solder on top of the wire um, which is just barely holding it in place. Um, it's actually quite poor quality uh, work there but it's uh, I guess one of the, the only hand uh, soldered pieces in the in the manufacturing process but um, you think they could have taken a bit more care there. We'll just touch that up and I'll, I'll also check the speaker and make sure that it's not open circuit or something. Right, so I think I've found the problem. The speaker is open circuit. Um, that was my initial thought because, you know, generally I don't think the uh, output amplifier and something like this would uh, have any reason to fail. So, uh, um, yeah, yeah, so the speaker's open circuit and I'll... Uh, just pop the oscilloscope onto the uh, on, onto, onto the output just to prove that there is sound coming out of it. I switch it on and beep, 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 beep. There you go. Not I can't make the exact sounds that it would make, but uh, proof that it's still alive. I just need to find a small speaker. Okay, I have uh, found a speaker. Uh, that looks like it was thin enough to do, do the job and uh, I got that from an old cell phone an old Senyo flip phone just happened to have a large speaker for the uh, uh, external speaker for hands-free uh, talking it's the model SCP 8200 
unfortunately, while I had two of these, I've, uh, I only recently threw one away. Uh, so I'm still going to have to find another speaker for the other, other radar detector there, but um, let's uh, connect this one up and uh, see if it does the business. Right, here we go. Bear, uh, speaker's connected. Let's turn it on. Excellent. Now I just need to get it back into the case and uh, uh, make sure it does. I'm sure it'll fit. Um, yeah, I might check out some uh, cheap kids toys or something. Um, um, there's bound to be a speaker out there that I can I can I can pillage out of something. Um, otherwise, I may have to buy ten of them online and uh, wait for God knows how long for it to get uh, shipped to the country. So, yeah. Alrighty. And one more time with the lid on, just because we can. Thanks for watching.